Welcome to Tech Support Tuesday. Today I'm going to go over USB cables. Chances are you probably have a lot of these just laying around and possibly breeding in your garage or other places of your home. So today I'm going to go over seven different types of USB cables that you might have so that you know what they are. On this, Tech Support Tuesday. Now, if you're new to the channel, every Tuesday I release a Tech Support Tuesday video, which is short like this one here. And on Fridays, I release more technical videos for mega nerds. So if you're into that kind of thing, then go ahead and make sure that you slap like and hit subscribe. Now, let's go over the cables. So you have a standard end here, and this is called USB-A. So this is what is going to plug to your charging brick or to your computer. And this end is USB-C. Now notice how it is round on both sides. So it doesn't matter if it is up or down because it is always in the correct position to be able to be plugged in. Now this cable here is your standard printer cable. If your printer doesn't support USB-C, then this is a standard USB-B connector on one end and again USB-A on the other. Now this cable is a USB mini on this end here and as you can see only fits one way and then on the other end you have your standard USB a originally this was for like smartphones many years ago and then they changed the form factor over to the next cable that I'll show you although still some items such as uh, microphones and other devices may still use a USB mini connector on it. Now this next cable is a USB micro. So USB micro ended up pretty much replacing as a standard on most devices from the USB mini that I showed previously. Now it does only fit one direction and you can also see some tiny little teeth on there so you can feel it as it like slides into the device and this became very popular on uh, most cell phones that are not Apple until it was replaced with the current standard which was USB-C. Now this cable here is for an external hard drive so this cable here is called USB Micro B. And the reason for that is if we look at the standard USB Micro, it is in fact the same end connector that is on this, but without the other piece next to it over on this side here. Now this cable is typically going to be USB 3 speeds. And one way that you can tell is that typically USB 3 cables are going to have blue plastic on the end right there instead of your standard white on the end of a USB cable. Now, that doesn't mean that it absolutely is not USB 3 uh, compatible. Now, these next two are a little bit interesting. So this is a USB A to USB A connector. And this is actually rated as a USB 3.1. And how I know that is that it came with this hub here, which is USB 3.1 uh, Gen 2. The way that this works is you have the USB USB A that plugs in on one side, and then the USB A that plugs into the computer on the other side. And for the last cable, this is a USB A male over to USB A female. So think of it as just a USB extension cord. If I have this really short cable right here, I can just go ahead and plug that directly into here. And now I've got a longer cable. Now, if you found this video useful, be sure to go ahead and slap that like button as it does truly help out my channel with the YouTube algorithm and consider subscribing. Again, I release videos on every Tuesdays and Fridays and I'll catch you in the next one.